hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is andy sinyandoya for those of you who don't know me thank you for being here i'm back in my country and i'm so happy god gave me journey masses i am so excited so today i am at home i'm in my mom's place and today i will ask her questions <laughs> and uh, let's see the answers she will give us you all know mothers are very important people to us and um, not only mothers let me say parents are important people to us and it's a privilege we should not forget about them we should always remember our parents even when they are growing old we should always be there for them let us not forget where we come from um, yeah so today i'll be vlogging dialect from my mom's home and i hope uh, for those of you who've never met my mom, today you'll meet my mom. <laughs> I will ask her a couple of questions, both in English and Swahili, and let's see how she's going to answer them. And yes, welcome and stay tuned. Don't forget to hit that subscription button, like, share, and comment. This is my OOTD today. <laughs> see? My shoes. My trouser and yeah I'm, i have a, a flu and that's why i'm just trying to cover myself despite the good weather in my country welcome back guys and stay tuned more so don't forget to like subscribe share and comment so guys my mom is here and i will tell her to introduce herself and then we start with the questions that i have for her today so mom yeah. how are you today i'm fine thank you what about you <laughs> i am good i am good yeah you look so good yeah, I'm good. Hmm? Yeah? Yes. yes 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 so introduce yourself to my subscribers yes i'm monica jerry mm -hmm. a mother of many kids <laughs> yes Boys and girls. oh yes and i am sick mm -hmm. jesus is my personal savior wow happy to be a child of god amen 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 so, mom, yes. I have a few questions for you. Ask. I will ask the first one. Yes. Um, what is your dream destination? Ni wapi unaweza penda kuenda? Last year, nilikuli, the, I think a few years ago, nilikulizo kaniambio na kuenda Mombasa. Eh. Na ulienda Mombasa na niliona ulipenda sana. Nilikurahia sana. Sana. Nilikuwa so, my first time mm -hmm. to step there. Mm. Na the first time uh -huh. kuingia kwa ndege. Eh. Kupitia juu ya mawingu. Wow. Nilifurahia sana. Mhm. Mm yes. Nilifurahia. Mm. Sasa nilifurahia kama ulifurahia. Mm. So what is your dream destination? Uh, Zanzibar. Wow, why Zanzibar? Mm. Fire huwa naona kwa kisha mm -hmm. unakaa ni kusuri sana. Mm -hmm. Mtu akienda ku Mm -hmm. yes. So for those of oh, breeze, okay. Yes. For those of you who don't understand Swahili, she says the way she sees it in the pictures or videos, she sees it as a very beautiful place, including the breeze that passes or surpasses through the ocean. Okay, so Zanzibar is your dream destination. Yes. Question number two. Yeah. <clears throat> if you had a whole day, where could you go? Ungepewa siku moja wende tu mahali na uh, mali tunataka kwenda na mtu wa kugaramie ungeenda wapi mimi na yesa enda masai mara wewe unapenda masai mara so mbona masai mara mbona si naivasha ni masai mara eh bwana sikia nikaone nikaje kwa hizo hot air balloon eh auogopi hapana okay Oh nice. Okay. Haya. Ingine, mm. swali ni what are you most proud of yourself as a mother or as Monica? Ah, uh, mimi niko proud because mhm mm Mungu amenisaidia, nimerea watoto ni wakubwa. Mhm. Mm Wanaona pile Mungu amewasaidia wanaendelea vizuri mm -hmm. na huwa nafurahia sana wakati wamekuja kunitembelea. Okay, mm -hmm. there is a fly passing through you. Mm -hmm. Oh, so you are happy because your kids are happy, mm -hmm. your kids are all grown ups, mm -hmm. and you are happy because God has helped you to reach where you are. Mm -hmm. That's what you said. Na tuko na afya. Oh, and we mm -hmm. have good health. Mm -hmm. That includes uh, both you and 
as the kids, right? Yes. <laughs> All right, nice, nice. Guys, don't forget to share my YouTube channel. Share, like, comment, and subscribe as you listen to our beautiful mother here. Mothers are great. Yes. Mom, you know I love you so much and I'm so proud of you. Eh? Thank you. Mm -hmm. Hi. What is your greatest accomplishment? Kuona ni mengangana na watoto, hata kukiwa na chida, na wamekua wakubwa. Oh, so for those of you who don't understand Swahili, she says she is so proud that she has struggled with the kids, even with the problems, and now the kids are big enough to take care of themselves. Isn't it? Yes. Perfect. What are you most afraid of? This is the next question. Mimi hile kitu na wakopa sana ni ja. Ja? Yes. Ok. Na wakopa sana. Mpono na wakopa hiyo nja sana? Ah, huwa si. Ja umi mea ikuwa na ja. So si kuisi huwa staki kuisikia ati ja inanikalibia. Exactly. Na pia shetani cha uli shetani huwa na mambo mingi mabaya. Huwa na na isaweka teke sana ni kimono. Okay, so she says poverty. Poverty is her worst fear and she wouldn't like to be where there is poverty because she has passed through poverty and for real, I can attest that it is very, very true. It has been a tough, tough, tough childhood memories. It was, it was tough, tough, tough for us. It's just that some of us, we don't, we don't speak too much. Aya. <laughs> Twendele. So I'm still here with my mom trying to ask her a few questions, trying to understand her more and more and more. <laughs> and uh, we had a break and now the break is over and now we continue with the questions. Yeah, don't mind my voice. I have a very bad flu. I think it's change of climate, but I am good. I'm recovering. I'm on the process of the road to recovery and I'm okay. So we continue, mom. Yes. Mm-hmm. So, what was the worst trick you played on your parents? Hakuna, sijai. Sijai, chizia wazazi? No. Hmm, hata moja. No. Hakuna siku watu ulienda inje usiku. Hakuna. He, ulikuwa mtuto mtiifu. Hakuna siku watu ulitoka nyumbani, kwa kosa kurudi. Hakuna. Hakuna. Nice, okay. Uh, was there a time when you could not afford to eat? Many times. Many times. Yes. With your parents or with us kids or with? With you kids. With us kids. Yes. <coughs> okay, okay, okay. Mm, and how can you describe that? Likuwa gumu. Shauri watoto walikuwa mefuatana. Hata kuenda kutafuta, ilikuwa a problem, na nikipata ilikuwa gakidogo. So haiku kwa inatoshea. Sana, ok. And sasa, let me say like, to avoid maybe another woman like you not to pass through the same situation, what would you advise the woman? Nike muabia, ni kwanza nikijua mtu kama huyo, nike muabia, asijidharau kama hana kasi mm. anze kufanya kitu kidogo mm -hmm. apate pesa kama kuuza ananua kitu anauza mm -hmm. anapata yoka profit mm -hmm. yoka profit mm -hmm. anaweka pahali mm -hmm. anaendelea anaza sivindu kidogo kidogo mm -hmm. na hivyo naisaidia mtu sana okay so mm -hmm. um my mom is saying if you are a woman and you don't want to go through that 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 road she said uh you need to have something small for yourself even if it's a small business that is giving you even if it's very uh, very little money for yourself to keep and if you have that money you can try and put some money aside and do something else that's what you said Yes. At least you have something for yourself. As a woman, you should have something at least for yourself. That is a very good advice to all the women and I think all the men also, isn't it? <coughs> not only or not only women, only also all the men. That's very good. Uh, was there a time you could not afford to eat? 
Yeye nimekuuliza? Yes. Ah okay 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 okay. Okay. This is the last question now. Okay. What kind of things make you happy now? Uh, now I suffer here. Ah uh, no. Mm. What kind of things? Ni nini? Ni vitu gani ambazo zinakufurahisha sasa hivi? Vitu. Mm. Anything that makes you happy now. What kind of things make you happy now? Na isasema. Mhm. Mm Niko na pahali pa kuishi. Mhm. Mm That's a home. Na samuka, mm -hmm. fanya ka kitu, mm -hmm. niko wakati nikiamuka nikijua nitaenda wapi, wapi? Mm -hmm. lakini siku hizi mm -hmm. niko na vitu vya kufanya. Wow. Natumia mikono, mm -hmm. to do something, mm -hmm. alafu napata kitu. Wow, wow, wow. Mm -hmm. That is very good. Mm -hmm. That is very good. Mm -hmm. So those are the kind of things that make you happy now. Hakuna kitu kingine? Kitu ni kingi lakini si sikasema sote. Okay. Ni hata watoto wananifurahisha, mm -hmm. wananisupport. Mm -hmm. So tunaenda safari moja. Okay. Na huwa naomba Mungu mm -hmm. atubariki sisi wote. Mhm. Mm Ndio tusaidiane. Mhm. Mm yeah, so she says she's so happy with what she has right now and that she's able to wake up and do something by herself and <coughs> she's so happy that she has her kids that they can help each other with the with to support one another. Oh, she, she has kids that they can help each other mm -hmm. together and through the road things might be a bit yeah, in, easy. In short, Mungu huwa anatusaidia, ametusaidia tusaidiane to see musigo kwa mtu mmoja. Oh yes. Mm -hmm. Oh helping each other like coming together as a family and helping each other. Mm -hmm. Oh. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much ma'am for the yeah. vlog today. Yes. <laughs> I'm sure it will be a very very nice vlog and it will be an eye opener to many people. Yeah. And I'm sure many people will be inspired by the words that you've spoken today. Mm -hmm. Many children will be inspired by the words you've spoken today. Mm -hmm. Many men will be inspired by the words you've spoken today. Mm -hmm. Also many women, grandmothers and people from all over the world. Mm -hmm. What can you say as your last words to the people all over the world who are watching you right now? My sasema, mm -hmm. Mutu awe akioba mungu. Na ukioba mungu hawesi akakuasha. Kila kitu mutu anataka aobe. Na awe na mungu always. Na awe anashukuru. Tunaona? Mm -hmm. Mutu akipata pesa. <coughs> mm -hmm. Akubuke mungu dia limsaidia kapata iso pesa. Ah. Aya akimushukuru. Mm -hmm. yes. So you are saying that people should pray to God every day. And they should thank God. They should be grateful for their life every day. Mm. And you say that when people ask God for help, mm. God can never leave them behind. Mm. He will always help them. Yes. Wow, that's a very, very, very mm. nice, nice mm. advice to the young yes. and Watu people. Yes, karibu na mungu, mm -hmm. na mungu nae atakuwa karibu na, na wawo. So my mom is saying people should be close to God and God will be close to the people. Mm. Wow, that's so yes. perfect. Mungu akiasha Mungu, Mungu naye atamwacha. So sisi tuwe karibu na Mungu. So my mom is saying that everyone should be close to God and that's very very good. Thank you so much mom. Thank you for gracing my vlog today. I am so excited. So guys, thank you so much. So what are your last words for the subscribers or people who are watching my channel or what did you tell them? Again Yenyo. to thank them for supporting me or eh, ask them to support. Ni kwa shukuru mm -hmm. wale wame kusupport na wale hawaja kusupport kwa edere kusupport. Thank you. Thank you so much. So we are done with today's vlog. We've had uh, the wisdom nuggets that our mom here has thrown to us today. And let's keep those words very close to our heart because she has very nice, 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 nice words that will help us in the future or even now. And also to the great, great grandchildren that will also listen to this vlog. Thank you so much, guys. I appreciate each and every, each and every one of you. So let's meet on the next vlog. I'll be doing, uh, I'll be <coughs> editing a vlog maybe later because I decided to take a rest uh, because I was feeling a bit well. So my next vlog will be about how I traveled on business class from Ankara to Istanbul and I will, I will uh, upload it soon, maybe this week. Thank you so much guys. Thank you for your support and be blessed everyone. Bye. 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 <laughs>